<laughs> Hello, crisps. Good night now. I've just modified me um, me Trigod Research. See the HDCD filter there? This is the last one they did, the Pulsar one. That's what it looks like out of the box. I'm using the external power supply on here to, to run the all cam. Because that transformer is adequate for this, but there's a few mods I need to do. I'd like to run all the digital side, which is this one, off a battery, which I'm going to do. I'll let you know how I get on with that. But in the meantime, see them little chips there with the copper on? That's the analog output stage. That's what amplifies the signal from the DAC chip, which is there, the tiny little thing next to the filter. I've seen how many OSCONs is in here. Now, I'm a tweaker, right? As you know, e home. That's the type of thing I would do when I'm modifying DAX, if you can still buy these capacitors. Now, notice how he's got linear technology um, voltage regulators. They're a lot more expensive, a lot more quieter than the, the 7805s. So obviously the, the ones on the analog output stage are the equivalent to the, um, the LM317T, but the other ones are 5 volts. It's a beautiful bit of kit. So I'm just enjoying the doing the difference, changing chips and trying the sound. So there's one ideal way you can do it is put sockets in and you can try different chips and see what the sound difference is and see what you like. But make sure you put them in the right way. And if you don't, bang, boom. <laughs> see the hole there? I'm going to put fit a coaxial there because it's BNC and I haven't got a BNC adapter. So I can connect it to me player. There we go. Try good research. If you see one on eBay, you can pick them up reasonable, really cheap. But the sound are awesome. Different league to um, the Cambridge Audio stuff and all cam stuff I've been modern. Some people claim that they're as good as the chords. I've never had a chord here and I wouldn't know. But I've stuck with this for a long time. Very natural sound. Well, see them capacitors there, I had to put them in. Or oh, see all the messy glue. Because on this model, it had about four little ones. And they, 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 they knocked up, they were overheated. So I've just put these in for now. I'm gonna get some better capacitors. All glued in place, see how? Looks a mess actually, let's sort that out. And that's the digital side. I can just disconnect that transformer and connect the 12 volt battery straight to it. There we go, I'll let you know how I get on. See when I get me glasses. Absolutely love Martin Logan's.